Hi folks, welcome back to our video series on working with the default slider. In this video I'd like to finish off with talking about the animation types that you can uh, work with in the default slider. Let's jump right into Dreamweaver and the library, sliders, default slider folder and open up the JS and finally the init slider right here, this init slider one file. Now scroll on down to the bottom of the page. We've included transitions at the very end. Now there are six default transitions that come with the product. You can remove the ones you don't want. And basically it's a matter of just sort of uh, watching. The, they are random so you'll sort of have to watch the effect take place and if you're not really happy with it then you can try and remove it from the uh, the transition effect here. To remove an effect simply you know select it and then delete it and then get rid of the extra comma right and it's a matter of removing them previewing it seeing which one does what it's very hard to destroy when it when the random it's very hard to describe which one does what when trying to preview it in the page here to keep things tied up because each template's going to be different uh, but what you can do to remove an effect if you're if you're there's something in there like a lot of folks will say I just want the picture to fade in and out well then you can just simply remove everything but the fade and any extra commas there that are not needed and just end up with something like that. You could just have that one transition effect. So there's a few things you can do. Like I said, there's, there's, there are a few nice effects in jQuery. Not all of them work well with the image uh, the, with the default slider. So we've just included the six that do work well and you can remove the ones that you don't like. And really it's a matter of tri trial and error to see which does what. Uh, because it really depends on the size of the picture, the type of animation, which ones you're liking and not liking. So, 